Good time of day, guys! My name is Godzi, and welcome back to another episode of 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. Last episode, we continued uh, Minami's story, which had her go back to 1945 in search of the Sentinel, and they found uh, Miura's Sentinel. And basically, it just showed everything that happened up until... Uh, Miura meeting her in 1945. So, yeah. Then we continue to Yori's story, which just had another odd dream. Um, yeah, with Okino and Izumi, so, yeah. And then we continued Megami's story, which was very odd. Um, so she had to shoot Miura, and she also had to shoot Amiguchi. And what I'm assuming from this whole gun mission is that she's making these sentinel startup summon buttons for, um, probably everyone at some point. But so far, she's had to shoot, she's been told to target A, uh, but she failed, naturally. Uh, she shot Miura in the forehead, um, she has to shoot Usami at some point. Um, she shot out Amiguchi. Uh, she'll probably shoot Juro and Iori at some point. And she shot Goto. So, yeah. Her story is very interesting as far as that goes. Um, part of me wants to continue it right now, but I think we'd be better off doing something else. Uh, I kind of want to continue Takamiya's story next, so we're going to do that. Huh? Huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yuki Takamiya. Alright, what do you got? Sakura High School Rooftop, 1985. So many mysteries about what happened in the girls' bathroom. But one thing's for damn sure. Nachan's definitely involved. Yep. Hmm. Gotta look for more clues. I'm guessing Tamao's going to show up again. Hey, see. Can't go wrong with apple juice. True. Me and Nachan used to drink it all the time when we were kids. So based. Okay. That damn he says there's some thing right. not put Hi, Tamao. Almost... What's there? You are. Yeah. I've been looking for you. <sighs> okay. Um. Let me get rid of these other buttons. So making... Nachan, we went our, but we still kept right. She's the only. She was in the truck. What was not? Oh, we have to bring that up to her. Right before the incident in the girls' bathroom, there was another Kisaragi chasing after Nachan. Yeah, which is weird. Kisaragi is also one of the names on that <laughs> list. So that means Four Eyes wants me to watch her. Okay, yeah. Something happened. Something that the she said not and described it. Nachan was things that could it have something to Okay, so I guess bring up the bathroom. Maybe we should look around the girls' bathroom again. Oh, didn't I tell you? They've started renovating. Oh. So Even we if can. we can get inside, there's nothing to see anymore. Well shit. Rat. That was fast. <laughs> Are you upset with me? Why? <sighs> Just been antsy without my cigarettes. Okay. It's been several days since Minami. I think this she is probably sick, the same. And she didn't run away. It yeah. seems like. Don't you have anything better to do? <laughs> Takamiya san, you are the home. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. I am the what? Please. I will do my. How would you like to. Erica Iba. I met Iba while I was seeing she like even my stupid frick. Yeah. Same thing. The wind feels nice. Been keeping this place all day. Shut up. Anything to talk so? about? <laughs> I love mystery. I've always won. <sighs> so yeah, there is another branch. Tokisaka Shrine front gate. I'm not playing pretend, you know. Uh, yes, of course. I am merely your capable assistant. Huh? Well, at least I'll try to be. Enter school building. Alright, class one hallway. Alright. Up. 
Gotta bring this up to somebody. Megami, perhaps? Have a minute. I got some things to ask you. Yes. Huh? She was... She's a name on the... Her name... Yeah. She's pretty dull. That damn... He says there's... They may not be put there on... Nothing. What? Okay, nothing then, I guess. Cannot know this girl. She's a name. Yuri. Yeah, same no thing. Heard. Tell me. Is there? No. Hi. Maybe we should. Oh, did they've started? Yeah, that's even the same. Can... Obviously. Oh, shit. Interview. Mm, the word has. Hi. Have a minute. I got some. Th now you've been going to not any new set. Oh. So yes. Oh, I mean, are you one of those? <sighs> yeah, oh, this is the you? same thing again. This is the first. Uh. Okay, same Deliosis again. Athletics building. Why not? All right. You. Okay, manager. Hello. 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 Captain. Did you need? This is all stuff I've already talked about. I wanted to ask. She skipped out, but I guess she did. She look. She looked fine. Right? <sighs> hmm. And then this track member. Oh. oh. Yeah, everything's the same again. Can I go into the room over here? Yeah, girls track and field room. Excuse me. That room is for authorized personnel only? Or not then. It's just a damn locker room. <laughs> Can't get in the locker room as long as that ditz is around. Guess I have no choice. I <laughs> gotta knock I her ass out. For her help. Erica. Yo, Iba. I want to take a look around the track room, but that goody two shoes over there keeps stopping me. Uh, you want me to be a decoy? <laughs> yes. What? You don't want to do it? Oh, good heavens! You and I are partners, Takamiya-san. I shall not let you down. Okay. Yeah, okay. Just hold her attention until I get inside the room. Wait for me out here when you're done. Mm. All right. I can see it. The prime eye there intent. Sure. All right. I beg your pardon. Oh, yeah? I would like to inquire about Minami-san. You too? Do, do, oh, do, do. was there someone else? Well... Okay, track and field room. Bum, 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 bum. I guess we check her locker. Hmm, tiny nameplates. Yep. Hmm. Not chance. Found it. This must be that notebook. The one that girl in Nachan's class was talking about. She said she saw her fervently scribbling into it. Interesting. Minami's notebook. What follows is an investigative record of important moments in time and space. Okay, record one. I have finally encountered my destiny. He has arrived from outer space. An actual extraterrestrial being. <laughs> in summary, Whoa. Aliens really do exist. Okay, girl. Yeah. An extraterrestrial being. Did Nachon make all this up? <laughs> or is it possible she really was abducted by aliens? Hmm. What follows? Record two. These advanced life forms have managed to conquer time and space itself. Who could have dreamed that their technology had such capability? An actual gateway to time travel. 
right in Tokisaka Shrine. Hmm. Tokisaka Shrine. Maybe Nachan went there. Either way, it's definitely a clue. Okay. And Minami Snowbook. What follows is an in record three. He says he's looking for a robot. It's called Sentinel Number Seventeen. Writing inside of it seems to enable him to fight against evil aliens. A robot. Hmm. Could this be what Four Eyes was talking about? Is this the weapon Shikishima is developing? Huh. Okay. Hmm. Not chance. Anything else? Nothing I haven't already. Okay. Anything else to look at in here? Huh? Oh, hi. I thought you were supposed to be distracting that girl. She was called over by her senpai. So, uh. off she went. <laughs> Okay. Doubt. This Maybe is... we should look. Oh, they've started. Right. Even if we can. Well, oh, shit. Is there nothing else to look at in here? I, I thought guess I, I told you to. Here. I can't. The locker room of the athletics building. Just think of the drama that unfolds here. <laughs> sure. Nothing else. Or locker. Nothing with the laundry baskets. Bags over here. Nothing. Shelf. Box. No. Okay, I guess we get out of here then. Exit. We gotta go to the shrine then, I would assume. Oh, hello. Doesn't seem like that's something I need to bring up to her. Black suit, hello. How I'm you doing? Takamiya, with the SIU. I assume you've heard about me. So you're the student on the inside. So you're not here to supervise me? What's the deal then? We received new intel. Oh yeah? Confidential information from Shikishima was brought here. About those weapons? Cram it, will you? Just ignore me. Worry about your own mission. Okay, anything okay. else, though? Don't talk to me. Okay. Alright, um... Past one hallway? Really? Thought I'd be able to go to the shrine. There's someone to bring stuff up to? Just Iva? I can bring it up to her. Can I help now? She was one. She's a name of Yuri. You know the one next to yeah. Tell me. Same deal. I guess we just run over here. The roof. I guess we can check it out. There's probably nothing there, though. Ogata was here in the other one. Yep. Hello, Ogata. Ogata. What's up? Oh, hip. Is your handkerchief... You really come all the way up here just to make fun of me? <laughs> I really ain't in the mood to deal with you today. Just leave me alone, will ya? Is that it? I really ain't just... Okay. Iva. I think it to associate. <laughs> okay. Obviously, I'd have to go to the shrine somehow, right? Classrooms or anything? Class one C. Maybe not jump or. Just the bathroom again. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, the athletics building. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> Tokisaka Shrine, front gate. get to the front gate somehow. I'm talking me. So you're the So you're what's the deal? We received confidential about the cram it. Just ignore it. Worry about it. Okay. I guess I gotta check out the fucking room again, right? But it's grayed out, like there's nothing else to check in here. I can't find anything else to do. And I walk so slowly in here too. Like on purpose or something. Yeah, there's nothing else in here. Maybe we should. Oh, did they've started even if we c Well, shit. Okay, so no, nothing in here. Exit the locker room. I have no idea where to go. <laughs> I got so yes I mean are you one of this is the same oh, text again this is the... uh... yes nope same dialogue have a minute I got what 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 huh? she, she's a name her name she's pretty yeah. In mm, the word has said. In mm, the word has. Okay, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing then. Maybe not. Or. The roof, uh, I guess, again. There's gotta be something with Ogata, right? There, there's nowhere else to go. Oh god. Hi. Oh, hell. Is your hanker? You really come. I rip. Just leave me up. Nothing to tell him. I just. Look. I have no idea what we're doing then. What follows? He says he's look it's called writing inside. What follows it these who could an actual gate To Oh, okay. There we go. Yo, where's Tokisaka Shrine? It's nearby actually. Alright, head to Tokisaka Shrine. You should Shrine. go check it out. Take me there, will ya? I'm gonna go grab my bag. I'll meet you at the front gate. Okay, front gate has been added to the thought cloud. Oh, hi, Ryoko. What's up? Shino no me. Something that the girl on the track team mentioned. Yeah. She said Nachan went and, and described it. At Is that it? Okay. What's up? Hey. Yuki Takamiya. Weren't you told not to contact me? Shino no me. There's something I need to speak to you about. Apparently, sure. So, before Natsunomi Nami vanished, I heard she was being pursued by men in black suits. If that's true, you've got some serious explaining to do. I've already told you. Natsunomi Nami has to do with my investigation. But I can tell you one thing for certain. We didn't kidnap her. If we had, 
There'd be no need for this investigation in the first place. Mm. Are you giving me your word on that? Well, she's just traveling through time. Assignment. Stranded in 45, I guess. Wait. But what do you want, bitch? There was something you said before. I haven't been able to stop thinking about it. You said you hid something for me. Did she? Oh, right. You told me to hide it. You don't remember, do you? It was in the passageway to the old school building. Old school building? You were watching something. It was being shown through a projector. And you started crying. Oh. A projector? Yeah, and you were saying something about Four Eyes. Mr. Ida? Oh. So sudden. Okay. My pills. <sighs> pills? Okay, so she's on medication of some kind. Uh, think about what happened at the old building. It wasn't too long after I transferred here. I saw her. Oh, hi. She's near the old school building. <laughs> Hold on a minute, Iba. We're doing a flashback. Hmm? I was thinking there were fewer people around here. So, this is the old school building. I heard it's gonna be demolished soon. Oh. No doubt it is old. It was built during the war. Seems like a shame, really. That would only this make place it 40. Is so quiet. Like... Would have been a perfect place to hang out. Sakura High, High School. If I had been serious about my studies, I wonder if I could have gone into Sakura the normal way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Huh? My ID is now registered. Okay. I'm shutting off your AI function. Search for it. It's somewhere in your memory. Okay. Look for the information on me and Mr. Ida. It was all a lie. Who is, is that? this me? From the future? That's you? His love was nothing but empty words. Mr. Ida. He was using me right from the very start. I was such a fool. We are all that remains of humanity. And still we deceive each other. So filled with hate. I have had enough. This can't be real. Humanity has always so he's been using her. To ruin. Okay. Yeah. Project Ark was a mistake. Project Ark. That but it is already in its second stage. Interesting. I cannot stop it. Like Noah's Ark All I can type do Ark, or is derail it. I have linked in parts of the terraforming project. The heavy machinery will then purge humans from all sectors. If everything goes according to plan, the final phase will be reset, and all sectors will fall into a never-ending loop. Mm. What remains will be a peaceful world. Finally free of humanity. No. I couldn't have. This place will be destroyed as well. The human race has reached its end. We have no need for a future. So future use a massive nihilist. What in the hell? <laughs> You should have picked a more secluded place for that, Ryoko. It can't be. Uh, uh, hey. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Maybe you're a bitch for a reason? Wait a minute. You're the girl that was with Four Eyes. Oh. Shinonome, right? It's This is only impossible. like your second meeting? Are you okay? Did I do it? Was it really me? I destroyed the world? Girl! No, I won't believe it. Mr. Ida would never deceive me. What are you talking about? 
There's no way. That isn't my future. Hmm. Just take a deep breath. Okay? Come on, stand up. Who were you talking about? Was it Four Eyes? It's like she if hasn't even acknowledged her. For, then what good are these? The pills? Oh, shit. What, a, what is the pill bottle? Is it the same pills as... That A takes? Here. According to Yori? Don't you need these? Why? Why are you trying to help me? Well, I just... You're my senpai at the SIU, so... Oh, yeah. That thing is crazy. <laughs> is it a new kind of projector or something? I guess we walk it up, examine. Huh. So how do you work this thing? So you just collapse? I want to see that video I just, I again. just heard like a flapping huh? sound. Yep. <laughs> hey, are you all right? Get that thing out of here, please. Don't tell Mr. Ida. Don't tell anyone, please. Okay. Nurse's office. Damn, she's done a lot of work, passed out. Jeez. Can't believe you collapsed on me like that. Hey, whoa. Morning. You sure you're okay to get up? <laughs> Let me guess, you don't remember anything, do you? Here. It's your medicine. <sighs> I'm sorry, you take... How many was that? Like three Mary or four? Mora made you take those pills too. It was the first thing she did when I carried you in here. Are you sure it's okay? To take so much of it, I mean. I don't understand. Why did you have my medicine? Yeah, she doesn't remember a thing. You threw the bottle on the ground, so I picked it up for you. I threw it? Yeah. Anyway, about that... thing. Are you sure it was okay? Huh? <laughs> what? Yes. The thing you told me to hide. <sighs> I said no such thing. Are you trying to play games with me? You were babbling on and on about that damn four eyes. And crying. A lot. What? Me? Don't lie to me. <laughs> the hell is going on with this girl? Fucking mystery. It literally just happened. <sighs> okay. Shit, seriously? What are those for, anyways? I can't think straight unless I take them. Okay. I uh, know, dude. It looks like bad news to Down me. Down on them like fucking potato chips. Morimura, I'm guessing. Yep. Oh. How oh, wow. How are you feeling? I'm fine. Takamiya-san, please just stay out of this. <sighs> hmm. Is something wrong? No. It's just... You don't look too well. Maybe some medicine would make you feel better. <laughs> okay. I'm out of here. <laughs> that fucking lighting shift. To be continued. Okay. Oh, there's a fucking branch there. Alright. Close results. Oh. <clears throat> We finally got her, Ryoko Shinonome's story. Alright. Jeez, 
Takamiya's locked like fucking how many people? She locked Usami, who was locking Ogata. And she was also locking Ryoko. And who was who she locked by? She was locked by Minami, right? Like, jeez. Alright. Well, that's that, I guess. Um, any new mystery files? Ryoko Shinonome 2188! Okay. In footage from 2188, Ryoko Shinonome is brokenhearted after realizing that Tetsuya Ida has been using her from the very beginning. She loses all hope for humanity and alters Project Ark so that the heavy machinery will purge humans from all sectors. Her goal was to trigger a reset every time the project reaches its final process, causing all sectors to fall into a never-ending loop. So, that seems to imply that she's responsible for all the kaiju? Not surprising that the bitch would be would would do that. Okay, so... Um, Takamiya, me from the future, suspicious pills, is that it? Just those two scenes? Yeah, so there's one thing split in there. Ryoko, me from the future, suspicious pills, not chance gone. Okay. And that's probably around the same time as the other ones. Yeah. Okay. Alright then, um, I guess since we just unlocked her, we might as well start her story. Alright. So, what kind of mindfucky bullshit are you gonna got get, Ryoko? The story of Ryoko Shinonome. Lunch period, 2064. Of course, yeah. Mr. Ida. Shinonome kun. Ah, oh, she doesn't have a bunch of bandages I have a question yet. Question regarding what we talked about today. Will you answer it for me? <laughs> hey, get over here, bitch. Mr. Ida? I thought I had made myself clear. You are to avoid contact with me while at school. <laughs> I will make an exception this once. What is your question? It's about your feelings, Mr. Ida. You said I was special. It's okay, you girl. are special. The thing is, I felt it too. The moment you arrived, I knew you'd be special. That something might happen between us. Girl? You're like 15. She, he's in his fucking like 30s, maybe Mr. even 40s. Ida, the substitute teacher. He's here to fill in while our teacher is on maternity leave. I've come to. Her find eyes are so fucking vacant. And comes with his own set of secrets. Okay. Mr. Ida, I've never, I've never felt this way before. Just thinking about you makes me. I have already explained to you what my position is. While you are important to me, to all of us, you and the rest of those chosen as pilots, your well-being is of the utmost importance to the mission. You do understand what I'm saying, don't you? Please don't cause any trouble for me, Shinonome-kun. Okay. It is true you are quite exceptional, Shinonome-kun. Your intelligence and adaptability are above average. And your piloting technique is more than sufficient. With you on our side, we stand a real chance. But you must be fully committed to the cause. To achieve victory, one must prepare with a full heart. And great tenacity. Victory. The internet has been talking of nothing but what happened last week. A group of invaders had come ashore. Hmm. Their attack held back by a mysterious robot. Okay. Mr. Ida, is your only desire to put me inside one of those things? If 
If we don't defend against the attacks on this city, it is no exaggeration when I say that the world will be destroyed. We succeeded in defeating them in the first battle. By ensuring that they were unable to reach the heart of the city, we were able to minimize the damage that was done. But the invasion is just beginning. That attack is nothing compared to what's coming. Okay. Hey, Hi, what's hey. going on here? What's up? Yo. Akun. Weren't you the one that said not to contact you? What do you want with Ryoko Senpai? Sekigahara kun. Stop, Akun. I'm the one who has to talk to him. Senpai. That is true. Nevertheless, we're drawing attention to ourselves. I'm leaving. Wait! I'll do it. If it's what you want, then I'll fight. Are you certain? Yes. I've made up my mind. Then we will meet after school. I'll give you more details then. Girl, you're just simping Wait. for a middle-aged man. I'm in too. You will fight as well. Yeah. I'll do it. I'll go with Ryoko Senpai. That is excellent news. Then I will see you after school as well. Okay. Are you sure about this? I am. Ryoko. Hmm. Okay, full scale invasion center of the city defensive battle 2064. Hi, Goto. You're also here. Matsuyuki Cho secured. Area D7. 23 remain in the seventh wave. Number 14 has secured a path. Just a little more. Don't stop. You're almost there. Number 14 has taken damage. Shinonome-kun, pull back. Assist number 14. Okay. Number 17. No response. Miss Morimura. 17 was Minami's. I'm not getting a response from Sekigahara either. No. Systems being attacked. From where? Through the laser link. The attack is originating from number 15. Sekigahara kun? Sekigahara is transmitting it to every sentinel. Oh. Hi, Juro. Our defenses are down. Juro, fall back! Our position has become critical. What's going on? It's throbbing. Both Sentinels are showing abnormalities in their system. I can't move. Is this that fucking memory wipe thing becoming a shell that A mentioned. Granted, he mentioned that in 24. Going to collapse. Right? I can't shut off the link. It's a mega me. We're going to lose all units at this rate. They're going to be wiped out. Use the force transmit code on all units. But we don't have time to adjust the settings. Do it as is. The link will be shut off that way. But we'll have no idea where they go. The pilot's lives are the priority. Okay. Number 16 and 13 have begun transmitting. Number 12 and 19 transmitted. 14 has completed transmission. No response from the others. How did this happen? The kaiju are almost here. We need to go. We can figure out the reason afterward. 
I was able to access the autonomous type number eight. They the numbers go that, that low? I thought they started at like 11 or whatever. Itakun. Please hurry. I'd rather not die a meaningless death. Miss Morimura, we need to go. Okay. Aftermath, City in Ruins, 2025. Oh, did we go back to the 2020s? Oh, wait! No, this is... All these kids... Because of him... When those three... Showed up. Mr. Ida. He stayed on the battlefield to the very end. All so we could escape. Okay. Do I go in here? This must be his hideout. So this is how she links is to a dangerous criminal. Usami's story. It'd be Four foolish to go in unarmed. Remember what Mr. Ida said. To achieve victory. The the shaking and the with great light shifts is, are freaking me out. <laughs> four two six. Prisoner number four two six. Who is that? That's what he was called when imprisoned in the future. And now he travels through time, trying to thwart our work. Oh. And who is that? This must be his hideout. 426 is a dangerous criminal. It'd be foolish to go in unarmed. So you need a gun or something? Remember what Mr. Ida said. To achieve victory, one must prepare with great tenacity. Okay. Phaser. Where? A gun made in the 2100s. Where was this hiding? If it comes down to it, I'll use this on him. On 426? That wouldn't be Ogata, would it? There's still some ammo left. Alright. In we go then. <gasps> or A? Ryoko san. Hi. I've got you cornered now, 426. Okay, he's, he's 426? It's time to pay for what you've done. I'm taking you in. And if I don't come willingly? If you want to resist, feel free. Just gives me a reason to put a bullet in your head. Okay. There's nowhere left to run, 426. Who told you I was 426? I saw the access logs. It was you, Eisaki Gahara. Hmm. The program that infected the Sentinels. It was created with 426's ID. Looks like someone left some foolish evidence behind. Okay. Whatever it is you're trying to do now, I don't care. But I can't forgive you for what you did to Mr. Ida. Because of you, he's... You... You're still going on about Ida? What to do? Die! We're done talking. I should kill you right here. <laughs> then do it. Shoot me. Go on. I'm serious. I'll do it! Huh? No. Oh. The trigger's locked. I'm the registered user. It won't shoot me. Oh. <sighs> Then fight. I'll take you on myself. <laughs> really? With those injuries? What are Besides, the injuries from, anyway? What are you doing? Empty. Like I thought. They'll wear off soon. Hells. <sighs> I'm sorry, Ryoko san. The one the ones she I takes, tried, sir. But I couldn't save you. Him. Okay. Up oh, to be continued already? Okay, shit. Shinonome's prologue queered.
Okay. Odd. Very strange. Okay, um... Ryoko Shinonome. Ryoko Sh Shinonome comes from the future, the destroyed world of 2064. Ever since the battle in 2064, her memories have been getting clouded. As her feelings towards Tetsuya Ida fuel her desire for revenge, she tenaciously... Yeah, that's how that's spelled, okay. She tenaciously seeks the culprit behind the incident. Unless she regularly takes her medication, she suffers an intense headache and amnesia. Oh, okay. Many of the first-year students will call her Shinonome Senpai. Senpai, defined as someone who preceded you in an organization, is used as an honorific here to show respect to a senior or superior. This is often used at school or places of work. Okay, cool. Oh, second generation. During the battle in 2064, A. Sekigahara piloted Sentinel number 15. Cool. Is that it? Okay. Um, let's look at the events then. So, that was her second event. Teacher and student. The Sentinel Infection Incident. 426's hideout. Interesting. So, that also adds... So, that's what happens right after Captain Pompadour. So, something else happens there. Same with Ogata. Goto, Sentinel Infection Incident. Oh, this is actually his first one. Teacher and student. Interesting. And 426's hideout. Okay. I guess we continue her story. I don't see why not. Yes. Alright. Ryoko Shinonome. Alright, what more is there? Oh, 1985, noon. Easy, Nurse's take your office. time. Do you know where you are? Hi. Shinonome-san? Oh, wow. Do you know what year it is? No. 1985. What's the last thing you remember? 426. He got away from me. I won't let him escape next time. <sighs> okay. I see. All right. Hmm. How are you feeling? My head really hurts. Uh, are these these flashes are because of her? I I thought it was because of something else. Is is it because of her mental state? Jesus Christ, that's a Design Maybe choice. I should keep you here for further observation. And the voices are getting internal clock just needs grainier. to adjust. You're putting too much of a burden on your nervous system. You need to stop shifting. Do you still have your pills? Make sure you're taking them. Is she the one that shifted Usami and the others? Pills. This should make me feel a little better. Yeah, that stopped the fucking weird shit. Okay. Take those when your headaches start to get bad. The medicine is a bit strong. You may experience some temporary side effects. But don't worry, your memories will return quickly. It's an interesting design choice. These pills are hard to swallow, but it's the only way these headaches will go away. Interesting. I need to go back. You can't time travel right now. But I need to fix the Sentinels before the invasion begins. You can't stop Invasion. Me. I need to go after him. I'm not trying to stop you. We just can't use the gate right now. Gate. Okay. The invaders appeared in 2064. They destroyed the world. Hi, Goto. But they won't stop. They're coming for us here, too. The coordinates for shifting through time. They're set in 40-year intervals. So oh. we can't travel freely. Okay. Are you alright? Who are you? <laughs> Miss Morimura. Yeah, she's got splits. Compatible boys and surveillance footage. Are you still overworking her? I've had no choice. Do 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 do. 
gate. Why can't we time travel right now? The gate has been sealed by someone. I'm looking into it. The gate is locked. There's only one person who could have done it. It's him. It has hey. to be. 426. Yep. The one that set up the gates in the first place. Oh, he did that? Okay. So we're stuck here? In the past? Hmm. Chat. Yo. And you are? Rinya Gotel. A second year, like you. I've been assigned to offer you support. <sighs> okay. Um, 426. The source of the disaster that will destroy the world. If we don't capture 426, there's no way we'll be able to withstand the invasion. But this happens before you, um... Think that happens with, um... The projector in Takamiya? I'll fix it as soon as I can. Okay. It's only a matter of time before 426 makes contact with someone. I need the list of those who are compatible. Of course. The compatible. That includes the people of this era, too. I'll see what I can do. There's no other option. If we don't find him, the result will be worse than anything we imagined. Hmm. Or would you rather... I go ask the students, one by one. <sighs> Fine. The file is on my desk. Okay. It isn't everyone, but... It does list those who are compatible at the school. Okay. The compatible. Humans with the capacity to pilot the Sentinels. They have already been identified in the future. Okay. List of compatible ones. So this is it. The plan to gather all the compatible ones. Four girls, including myself. Wait, only girls? Compatible girls. Fuyusaka and Kisaragi. Class 1B. Yeah. Yakushiji and 1C. And then Minami? All of the compatible girls Oh, no, wait. Yeah, in four including you. Interesting. These files are only for the girls. That's all we have here. Gotokun has information on the boys. Oh. You can consult with him. Okay. Sup? It's a pleasure to be working with you. <laughs> compatible boys. Tell me who the compatible boys are. Certainly. But there's something I'd like to ask you first. I wonder. Why do you hate 426 so much? Are you serious? <laughs> the fate of the world is at stake. Even so, I sense your hatred stems from something else. <laughs> hmm. I don't have the list, therefore I don't know. Renya Goto has the information I need. Okay, makes sense. If I get any information on him, I'll let you know immediately. Okay. Because he ruined the Sentinels. Because he destroyed my home. That thing deserves no sympathy. 426 is not human. He's an AI created in the future. And now, he calls himself A. Sekigahara. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. A picture of 426. You just he have a photo of him? Sekigahara <laughs> now, but he's gone into hiding. Oh, is she and why the black the suits Sentinels, go after him then? The disaster that will destroy the world. That would make sense. If we don't capture 426, there's no way we'll be able to withstand the invasion. Okay, um... Tell me who the compatible boys are. 426 could try and contact one of them. Or maybe he already has. According to the clock on the wall, it is time for lunch. Rad. We should be in the cafeteria now. Let's go. Oh, okay. Sure. Okay. So crowded. What's up? 
I don't have the list. Renya Gota. So, where are the compatible ones? I don't see any from here. Hmm. Oh. Speak of huh? the devil. Yo. Shinonomi Senpai. You know her? Good timing. We were just looking for you. He's one. Kuyusaka and Yakushi. No. The girls can wait. I need to focus on the boys first. Okay. That's Shu Amiguchi. He's one of them. Okay. I have a question for you. Have you seen someone that looks like this? Hmm. No, never seen him. Hmm. I see. Hmm. Oh! Hi, Takamiya. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> Were you able to get your bread? You need my help with anything? <sighs> About last time. I wasn't able to do anything then. But I want to make up for it. You did try. And I'm grateful to you for that. Where are you going? <laughs> Would you quit talking to me in front of other people? Dorks. What is this strange feeling? When I see him talking to another girl, my chest feels so <laughs> tight. Right, because he looks like Ida, right? It feels like I'm jealous. No. About him? That's ridiculous. There's no way. Strange feeling. My head. Oh. It hurts. Again. Alright. Fuck him, pills. This should make me feel a little... Okay, um... Kuyusaka and Yakush. All of the compact... The first year classrooms are on the third floor. Yeah. Shu Amiguchi. I get a strange feeling when I think about him. It's almost like... I'm in love with him. Sure. Alright, sup? Now what? I don't know. I guess we leave. Where are you going? The third floor. Time to find the compatible girls. <laughs> the fact that Goto only tells her about Amiguchi and doesn't tell her about anyone else is Where are odd. the compatible ones? I should look at the pictures in their files. Check the compatible girls list near a student. Well, the thing is, I know what they look like. There's Kisaragi. Tell me Kisaragi. Yeah. Kisaragi-san, can I talk to you? <gasps> Goto senpai. <laughs> Is there something I can help you with? Anything at all? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> do you like sweet senpai? Oh, so fucking oh. snarky. It's funny. <laughs> what sort of women do you like? Have you seen this well, person before? I. <sighs> What do you do on your days no. off? I'd rather hey, not what's say. what's going on? Why are you doing this? What? You need to run. What's going on? What? Did something happen? No, all good. Come on, Mibuko, let's go. Run away. Run away? Why do I need to run? Probably something to do with her story. I don't see... <laughs> My oh, come on. <laughs> yummy, yummy pills. He calls himself Ace. If I show it, maybe I can... Okay, yeah. Megami. Megami. Yo. Yakushiji-san. Can I talk to you? Have you seen this person before? That's 426, isn't it? You know him? I mean, I've heard about him enough times by now. So Morimura told you. You know, the way you're acting, it's going to be difficult for you to pilot number 14. 
Number 14? Hmm. Sentinel number 14. Number 14. Number 14 is my sentinel. Yori would have to be somewhere now, right? Oh, remember, sure. Hmm. Shikishima Industries Sentinel Hangar. Oh, hi, Morimura. This is number and 14. Megami. The one you piloted. I'm glad we were able to recover it. Hmm. Yo. Even in Shikishima's largest hangar, it was barely able to fit. Transporting it here was quite the challenge as well. But now, including number 14 here, we've been able to recover three Sentinels after the incident. Unfortunately, the new models are all still missing. We hmm. also have yet to find number 12. Number 12 is and who's? Okinokun too. Would that be Hijiyama's Sentinel then? Maybe? So are the Sentinels fixed? With the systems infected as they are, repairing them will be no easy task. And now that he's taken control of the Sentinels... So unless we capture 426, we won't be able to use the Sentinels. I see. What's her deal? Uh, oh, yes. Let me introduce you. This is Megumi Yakushiji-san. Hello. She's Howdy. one of the compatible from the year 2025. Okay. Worst case scenario, she will be piloting the Sentinel instead of you. What? Hmm. I won't allow it. Piloting effectively is not possible in your condition. But number 14, Mr. Ida chose me for it. It's my Sentinel. Then you're the one who should have been in it. No. Bitch. If you're really that possessive of it, then why didn't you fight instead of Juro? It doesn't matter. You'll forget this too. Just like everything else. Yakushiji. Okay. Holy fucking cat fight. Jesus. <laughs> Alright. Damn. Okay. Hey, Sekigahara. He comes from the distant future of 2065. Yeah. Anything else? No. Not at all. Okay, um... So, the pilot of Sensa... Oh, wait! This is after this! Okay, huh. I would've thought that'd be before it, but whatever. There was actually no other new archive things there. I guess because it was just a bunch of inspecting and stuff. And Usami said some weird shit, too. Hmm. So we're just at, okay, after dreaming of UFOs. Wait, what? Oh, because they're in 85. Oh, I thought, okay. I thought they were in 25 for some fucking reason. No, they're still in 85. That makes more sense then. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> so where does that fall in in the main timeline? Okay, that's the one in between this, um, right, and that. Okay, sure. I suppose so. Okay, um, we're at 29%, which means we're almost able to unlock the next area. Very interesting. So she's got, oh wow! Surveillance footage. She's got a lot of splits. Holy shit. Juro Karabe, run away. Huh. Very strange. Okay, well, I guess that's gonna be it for this episode. Um, I, I probably shouldn't say this. 
but the game's been sw slowing down quite a bit with the mind fucks. The story's still good. I, I, I don't mean to make it sound like I'm not entertained still, but like the crazy mind fucks are kind of slowing down at this point. Um, but considering that the overall story is only at 29%. Yeah, that's that's gonna change <laughs> But yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode guys if you liked it Then be sure to press the like button and if you didn't like it then fuck you too Remember to subscribe follow me on Twitter and hit that notification bell to stay up to date on All my videos and stuff and as always my name is Godzi and I will see you all next time Goodbye! Yeah!